Hey guys, YouTube World 100 here. Alright, yeah, and I just wanted to make a video to just really, like, do something as a goodbye to Toys R Us. So, yeah, I know just about all of you heard about it. Like, earlier this year, Toys R Us announced since, like, they filed for bankruptcy, like, last year. Earlier this year, the Toys R Us announced that they would be going out of business. And as of today, like, I think, like, all the remaining Toys R Us stores ended up, like, now, like, closing down for good. Oh, man. And, I mean, this is just, like, really sad. I mean, yeah, Toys R Us, like, has really become, like, a... It really has become, like, one of the biggest store franchises ever. I mean, yeah, Toys R Us is, like, along the lines of, like, store businesses, like, a Walmart and Target and Kmart and just a lot of other popular like stores and you know just Toys R Us is among those lines and yeah Toys R Us really has become like is like the biggest toy store franchise ever really and yeah it's just sad that Toys R Us has now like been forced into just like liquidation really and just really like they've now gone out of business and this is just, like, really, really sad. I mean, you know, growing up, like, Toys R Us really was, like, one of my favorite stores to really visit. I mean, I I can't tell you how many times growing up that I went to Toys R Us. I mean, yeah, I've just, like, had so many, there were just, like, countless times that I went to Toys R Us growing up. I mean, I visited it so many times. Like I was just said, it was, like, one of my favorite of stores to visit growing up. And... I mean, I just, like, growing up, like, I just, like, as a kid, I had, like, so many toys that I got from there. It, it just really was, like, a real personal favorite store of mine to visit. And, yeah, when I heard that they were, like, going out of business, it just, like, really, yeah, it was just, like, so sad to hear. I mean, especially with, like, I know, like, a lot of you probably were the same way. Like, when you were growing up, you visited Toys R Us a lot for toys as well. So, yeah, a lot of people are probably, like, feeling the same way that I am about this. And, yeah, even, like, like, every, yeah, I just really don't know what to really say. It just is, like, a really sad thing to see. And, yeah, I mean, like, I just got, like, so many memories from Toys R Us. I mean, from, like, video games to actual toys to like board games like I've just there were like just so many things at Toys R Us that I had from there growing up and just to see that they really like are now like they're gone pretty much it's just like a real sad thing to hear I mean yeah I'm sure that a lot of you have like seen like the photo that went viral just I think it was yesterday where like it just showed like the empty to inside of Toys R Us and it showed the mascot at Jeffrey the Giraffe just like with his suitcase and stuff and an empty the uh the empty store and yeah basically like saying that he, he's like gonna leave and look for other work and stuff or just yeah basically like he's basically leaving and yeah a lot of people have just said like how like heartbreaking that photo is and yeah it is like really sad to uh see he just like see like the mascot really just like being being like yeah he lost his business pretty much yeah, I mean, if you haven't seen the photo, like, I'll, like, I'll have a f link for the photo in the description if you want to, like, see this photo if you haven't seen it, because, yeah, a lot of this really has, like, broken a lot of, like, people's hearts, and, yeah, it just is kind of, like, a sad photo to see, and, yeah, there was even, like, a photo that I found just the other day with, like, it's showing that uh, there's, like, this photo with the Jeffrey the Jeff with a tear in his eye. And it just show, says that I will always be a Toys R Us kid. And so, yeah. It, yeah, and, yeah, that's just basically how a lot of people feel that way. I mean, just with the Toys R Us closing, they'll, they say they will always be a Toys R Us kid. Yeah, so, yeah, I mean, it just is just a really, like I said, just a really sad thing to hear with like this this such a popular or a store franchise has now just been put out of business yeah it just is that i mean yeah, and like toys r us isn't just the only 
like store that has gone out of business like over the last several years there's been a, like a lot of other like chains chains that have like just gone out of business due to bankruptcy or whatever it is it's just like Toys R Us did because you know of course like I'm sure like like as everyone knows like Blockbuster ended up like going out of business because of bankruptcy and yeah there have been other like stores that have gone out of business as well like uh Radio Shack went out of business it's a uh, a lot of like Kmart has been going out of business like I've just been seeing like there's just well when did Kmart close down I don't know if like they're like I'm not sure if there are still some more Kmart's in business but yeah there's a lot of Kmart's that have closed down and even like there's been a lot of like I've seen like Safeway grocery stores been closing down including like there's one that I usually go to have gone to for grocery shopping and that one is closing down also and there's been like some other like Safeways that I have seen that those have been closed down also so yeah there's just like showing that a lot of stores have been closing down and I guess it's just showing like the economy that we're living in now just it's it's really sucking and it's causing like all these chains to go out of business and yeah and like with this bankruptcy stuff like going on this is like something that I really don't like about like all this uh, new online stuff like we have like these things like a Netflix and Voodoo where like people would like watch these movies now now and stuff and yeah we do have like this like the online stuff with eBay and Amazon stuff when like more people do their shopping on there now instead of actually going to the store for the stuff and that's this is something that I really don't like about those this online stuff is just because it's causing like all these like all these stores that people do actually used to go to before it's causing all these stores to close down So, yeah, it just is, like, that's something I really don't like about it. It's just they're forcing all these, like, popular chains into, like, bankruptcy, and they're put out of business. So, yeah, it's just, like, it sucks to see this, and especially, like, this one. This one is just, like, the one that's probably affected me the most, just because, like I said earlier, I just, like, Toys R Us was one of my favorite stores or to visit growing up, and just that it closed down now, it just is sad to hear. I mean... Yeah, I visited like so many times growing up and even now like as an adult, I still did like, I still did like going to Toys R Us like from time to time just to go in and just look around because I mean while well, like I probably wouldn't, I didn't buy anything, it was just like a good like childhood feel just to like just go back in and walk around and just like relive the childhood days of the times that I did like always visit there and buy stuff. So, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, it's just, like, really sad that really, I'll never get the chance to do that again. So, yeah, and, yeah, so, and of course, like, it's not just Toys R Us, like, the entire, like, all these other, uh, Toys R Us related stores are closed down also, like, uh, Babies R Us and Kids R Us and, yeah, all those other R Us stores. Yeah, just that whole, the whole franchise has been put out of business. So, yeah, it really sucks, and especially since, like, 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 uh, Last September, uh, my youngest sister actually had a baby, and so, yeah, you know, yeah, I was feeling like, like, we could have taken him to Toys R Us and given him some toys, and even now, like, my, like, my other sister, like, she's now pregnant also, and she's gonna have a, a child as well, so, yeah, and it really sucks that they'll never get the chance to actually visit Toys R Us, really, like, how the older generations did, so, yeah, it just sucks that now any, like, new generations won't have the same experience that like the older generations like me had where they were able actually to visit an actual toy store store and pretty much have the time of their lives because that's Toys R Us is really like just what every kid has loved, loved I mean just it's all toys and we're just able to just run around and basically like be like like just have times of their lives I mean kids love toys and yeah this Toys R Us was just like the biggest toy franchise that there was and just to know that's gone now Oh, yeah, it just is, it's a sad thing. Oh, uh, so, yeah, but who knows, maybe, like, someday, maybe Toys R Us could actually come back and this. I mean, do you guys think it could happen? Because, remember in 2012, like, there was a time a uh, Hostess actually did, like, end up going out of business for a little while, but then, like, a few months later, it came back in business, so who knows, maybe one day that could happen with Toys R Us, and maybe they will be back in business someday. I mean, we can only hope, right? I mean, it probably, there's probably, like, not a very, it's probably not very likely, but who knows? Anything's possible, right? Maybe one day it could come back in business. So, yeah. 
yeah, we can only hope, right? So, yeah, I guess I'm just like, I'm pretty much just rambling on about this now, but yeah, I just like, I just want to just say as much in honor of Toys R Us as I possibly can, because yeah, it's just, it was, it's just one of my favorite store chains of all time. I mean, I visited it so many times growing up. I mean, I loved going there and uh, gonna miss it. I'm gonna miss this store. And yeah, a lot of you probably are too because yeah, a lot of you that probably grew up a lot going there shopping for toys as well. So yeah, I think that a lot of us are really saddened to see Toys R Us gone. But yeah, well, it has left so many memories and like the slogan has said for like that photo I was talking about earlier, we'll always be a Toys R Us kid. So yeah, we'll have so many memories of Toys R Us and yeah, the memory of Toys R Us will live on forever. So yeah, so yeah, I guess like that's all I can really say about it. So yeah, uh, so yeah, I guess like I hope you guys I like, do enjoy the video. I mean, yeah, let me know how you feel about Toys R Us. You can comment it on my channel. Let me know if, how you feel about Toys R Us closing down. And yeah, just, yeah, it's a sad thing. It really is. So, yeah. So, yeah. It's just, yeah. Sorry about your business, Jeffrey. Yeah, <laughs> Jeffrey's not a, actually, he's not a real draft, so I don't really know why I'm saying this for. But, yeah, just, yeah, that photo of we're just seeing uh, Jeffrey just in an empty Toys R Us store it was, a, it was a pretty sad photo and yeah I just saw like as Toys R Us like it just like in the last week as it, it has been coming to a close and the store's been empty and you've just seen like the stores having empty shelves and stuff so yeah just it's a real sad thing to see but yeah the Toys R Us name will live on forever through all of us that grew up with it so yeah I hope we so I guess that's all I really have to say about it, so, yeah, hope you guys did enjoy the video, hope, like, the Toys R Us memory will live, memories will live on with you guys, and, yeah, it's just never enough, so, yeah, I guess that, that's all I have to say about it, so, yeah, thanks for watching, and rest in peace, Toys R Us, so thanks for watching, I'll see you guys later.